Hey guys, what's up? It's Jonathan with One Big Impact. I was just scrolling through and periodically, I don't know if you guys, know, you guys have noticed, but I'll post like uh, different quotes on the Facebook group, Healthy Living for a Healthy Life. But I just wanted to elaborate on one in particular just for a minute. Now, not to talk too long about it, but I wanted to say the importance of being kind to yourself. Um, I, I don't think we really, I probably don't put enough emphasis on that in the group or in my daily life or in my own practice for myself. I just put one up and it's pretty profound. It kind of struck me, it struck a chord with me. It said, what kind words have you said to yourself today or something like that? Actually, I can tell you exactly what it says. Yeah, it says, what kind words have you said to yourself today? Now, think about that. What have you said nice to yourself today? Have you said anything, you know, when you woke up? If, you're, if you've had weight issues or you're self-conscious or you have body image issues or anything like that, the first thing that you did, I'll tell you the first thing that I did. I'm not going to say that you're any which way, whatever. What I'm going to say is what I do. And if you can familiarize with that or you can um, understand, let me turn off the fan real quick. Hold on. If you can understand where I'm coming from or if you can relate to that type of um, thing, then that's great. Hopefully, well, I mean, it's not, it's not great, but it's good that you, you can relate. So I wake up in the morning and, and I'm being totally honest. I'm not saying this is good or this is bad or whatever. I'm just saying on a daily routine, I wake up in the morning and if I go to, um, the bathroom, Maybe I take a shower. First thing I usually do is go to the scale and I'll weigh myself. And once I weigh myself, if I haven't lost any weight or I kind of stayed the same or I gained weight, I will instantly start thinking of myself negatively. I'll think, you know, you're a loser. You're like, you haven't, like, what, what are you doing wrong? You, 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 you you can't keep your mouth shut. You just like all these things just start coming into my head. And I'm not saying send me a message about this or anything. I'm not trying to get pity or anything. I'm just explaining to you what I go through because of my self-conscious, my body image issues and things like that. Like it's a real thing. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm, I'm a really confident person. Um, but these are so prevalent in my daily life. Um, so I'll go, you know, one of my worst things is if I go take a shower, I'm not sure ever once in my life, in my life with my shirt off, have I ever, ever liked what I see. Normally when I look into the mirror, I think, you know, why was I stuck with this body? You know, why was I stuck with this nonsense? Or I'm like, oh my gosh, that's gross. Like, you know, all these parts and it's just like, no. Um, I won't, I don't think anybody, 99.9% .9 of people I've ever known in my life will never see me with my shirt off. It's just something I don't, I'm not comfortable. I'm not comfortable in my own skin. Um, I'm not, I'm confident, but with a shirt on. Um, I'm not happy with what I, what my body has become. I'm not happy with, um, you know, my life. I'm, I'm not happy where I'm at with my life as far as like, you know, I'm 36. I stay with my mom. I'm happy because I never left my children. Um, but if you start to see what I'm talking about as far as like this trend of just crap talk about yourself, you know, I'm not happy with my income. I'm not happy with my unfinancial stability. I'm not happy with 
my inability to get a new vehicle. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I'm not happy with my inability to pay off bills. I'm not happy with all of these things. And I'm not saying I'm not happy. I'm just saying like if you start thinking in this mindset all day long, you will just think about all these bad things, all of this horrible self-talk. It's just like it is so damaging to your soul you have to stop it like you have to stop saying such horrible things and like one said just a minute ago if you wouldn't say it to your best friend then why the hell are you saying it to yourself you know what I mean if your best friend took off their shirt and say they were going swimming or whatever would you say ew gross that's disgusting put your shirt back on Maybe a dude would say it, you know, to another dude just joking around or whatever. But like, a, you know, if you had a, a friend or whatever, just that you were nice to. <laughs> and you weren't a jerk like me or something. Like, would you say that to them? No. Then don't be saying that to yourself. You can't treat yourself worse than you're treating others. Because to be completely honest, people come and go. And you're always going to be there for yourself. Like... You're the only constant that you will guarantee have for the rest of your life. Now, I'm not trying to bring you down as far as those people might not be around, but let's be honest. Um, if you're kind to those around you that may not be guaranteed to be there forever, why don't you be more kind to the one person that is in your face every single day? I'm challenging you to wake up every single day and start in the mirror. I don't care. Take your clothes off. Do whatever. Do whatever your most vulnerable position is. Mine's with my shirt off, okay? And I, I, I just, it irks me. So I'm going to do my own personal thing, and when I wake up every morning, I'm going to say five nice things with my shirt off in my most vulnerable position so that I can start to practice to feel better about myself, even when it's hard for me. A lot of us have gotten issues maybe from people in our childhood that said things or just our own self-doubt in ourselves, self-humiliation or just feeling bad about ourselves. And it's just wrong. It really is because I know firsthand each and every single one of you guys that I have worked with are absolutely beautiful souls. And it's really hard because I know that there's many of you guys out there that are horrible to yourselves, including myself. So this is kind of just not really a direction other than to please be kind to yourself. Please. You know, if you have to, message me. You know, message me saying, hey, I just wanted to tell you my five nice things today. Um, you know, for accountability or whatever. Because, you guys, let's be honest. Like, you're great. <laughs> you do really nice things for people. Um, you support other people. Your beautiful soul. What's out here is not always what it's all about, okay? Yes, I want you to love your body, love yourself. We all have to learn how to do that. And it's freaking hard, you know, especially when your body's changing. When you gain weight, you lose weight. Your body is not what you wanted it to be. But you have to understand that you have to love what you have. Because trust me, if you didn't have a life anybody would work anybody would work you know what I mean like you have to be thankful for what you have I understand it's hard it is difficult when your body changes or you age or whatever I just realized where is it you see it look at those freaking wrinkles what the hell is that I'm like 36 dude and I got like these wrinkles and somebody said it the other day they're like they go you got a baby face but I can tell you're like 40 because you got those smile lines and I'm like I'm never smiling again. <laughs> like, who says that to somebody? I was like, jerk. Jeez, man. No, but, like, we are all changing, evolving, turning into greater and more fabulous people each and every day. I promise you we get better with age. Just like cheese and whiskey. What? <laughs> no, it's seriously. Love yourself, guys. Wake up every day saying something amazing about yourself. Because, dude, we could say bad things all day long. For every one bad thing you say, 
try to say seven good things. Wake up and say five good things to yourself every single morning. I promise you, it will help. Have a beautiful day, guys. Remember to spread love, not hate, and especially to yourself. Peace, guys. Oh, say five nice things, nice things to yourself below. Do it. Do it. Do it. I don't care if it's hard. Do it. Right now. Right now.